Yo, what's up guys, Tuni here, back with another video, and today we got a bit of a different video. Today we're showing off my complete Tuaru collection. So you know, obviously Rail Gun is a magical index, I've been a fan of it, I've been covering a lot of videos. So my collection I've grown quite a bit from once I first started watching this series, I have like a lot of manga, figures, blu-rays, art books, wall scrolls, so we're going to show it off in this video. So if you want to see more Tuaru content and anime merch related videos, make sure to subscribe. Alright, let's just get started with the English manga. So I actually have a complete English Tuaru manga with volumes 1 through 25 of a certain magical index with a few rare volumes being out of print like volume 9 and like volume, I believe volume 3. Some of them are pretty hard to find. Then we got a certain scientific rail gun 1 through 15 volumes, no 1 through 16 and volume 17 comes up pretty soon. So obviously the super rare volume 7. Then we got a certain scientific astro buddy 1 through 4 complete. I'm pretty sure these are pretty common and not too hard to find. Then we got Asurian Scientific Accelerator, Volumes 1 through 12. Complete, I don't believe there's any rare volumes, maybe like Volume 5, for example. So that is a complete collection. Asurian Magical Index is done by Yen Press, and Railgun, Astro Buddy, and Accelerator are done by Seven Seas. Moving on to English light novels, I have a few volumes of Old Testament. I sadly don't have a complete set, but this is what I currently have for Old Testament. A few of them are pretty common, so I can just kind of pick them up on rightstuff.com or like Amazon. But I haven't yet, because volume's like $14, it adds up. And there's a few out of print volumes that are a bit expensive, like about $50. So maybe one day I'll complete my Old Testament set. Moving along, we got some Japanese volumes. So first up, we got this New Testament volume right here. This is just New Testament 20. I got this at Kinokuniya. It looks cool because I had New Testament's Toma design. And I thought it looked cool for the collection. Then, you probably saw the video on this, we got a certain scientific mental out, right there, pretty cool. Then we got a certain scientific dark matter, love this volume, hopefully 7 C's will get this, because it makes perfect sense. Astro Buddy ended, Accelerator ended, they should pick this up. And next up, we got this Railgun Anthology, I picked up by Kinokuniya. This was a really cool find, by the way, I was super excited. We got some Japanese volumes, enough for the last one. We got a Sarah Scientific Real Gun Volume 17. I got Impatient. It's coming out by 7 Cs. So once the English release comes out, I'll pick it up. So I guess I just have both. Next, let's move on to Blu-rays. So I actually don't have a complete set. This is all by Funimation, well, which is now Crunchyroll. But at the time, these are released when it was just Funimation. So we got the two Essentials re-release of a certain Magical Index. So you got Index 1 and Index 2 completely sealed right there. So yep, these are only like $25 a piece on rightstuff.com. So, like, look at that. These are awesome. I was pretty excited that these got re-released for such a great price. They were never hard to find, specifically, but it's just great to see that they care about Index. Then we got Index 3 right here with the slip cover, and I swapped out for the Light Novel artwork. But, yep, this is pretty cool. I don't own Part 2, so my Index collection is not complete because I'm missing Index, part, index 3, Part 2. Then we got the Index movie right there pretty cool so that's it for index then we got rail gun season one completely sealed and then of course we got rail gun s right there and that's sealed as well so surprisingly enough i don't have rail gun t and i don't have accelerator so i'm missing both parts of rail gun t accelerator and index three part two Hopefully they will make a Railgun T similar to this Railgun and Railgun S. That's what I'm hoping for and waiting for. But if it takes longer than expected, I'll probably just pick up the two parts. Next up, we got this Japanese Blu-ray limited edition of the Index movie. So we got the light novel artwork, but look what comes in it. It's so, so awesome. So I got this like, so get out of everything. I got this hardcover. I got this from Japan. Oh, I didn't go to Japan. I got it online. So I got that. And the stuff that comes with it is pretty cool. It's like a hardcover slipcase. We got just some ads and stuff like that. If you see like right there, just some ads. Then we got this. This is like the script book. I'm really not sure what this is specifically. I know one of you guys probably know in the comments. But it's like script or something like that for the movie. Then we got this art book. So it's like character illustrations, like important scenes in the movie. So... This is super cool right there. Then it comes with this actual like movie strip. And the strip I got is actually, if you can see it, super hard to see. We got Toma right there. 
I know it's gonna be super hard to see. Pick this up on camera, but it's like Toma and a movie strip scene. So that's super, super cool. That's like one of the coolest things I own. Let me put that back together. And then we got like this super hard plastic Blu-ray that comes with the soundtrack, the movie on Blu-ray and on DVD. Actually, no, I think this is extras. So it comes with like the Blu-ray movie, the soundtrack and like extra stuff. So that's honestly really cool. And it's such a cool set for the price. So for the figures, I have a total of four scale figures and two ninjoids. So first up, we got this Misaka 17 scale from Kotobukiya. I love this figure. Again, I was super excited that it got a re-release by Kotobukiya. Picked that up, super excited. Then I got my two Iman toy scales. These are my two favorite figures in my collections, or one of my favorites. We got the Accelerator 17 scale. That figure of Accelerator goes for quite a bit of money now, so I'm glad I was able to pick it up. I did pick it up on the aftermarket. I didn't pay too, too much over retail. That looks great. Then we got Misako 17 scale by Iman toys as well. Looks great. I love the lightning effects. It's super tall and dynamic. Then we got another accelerator, 17 scale. Uh, who did this one? I'm not too sure, but it's a 17 scale from like, I believe index two. I have it sitting in this position, but it does come with a base that you see here. Then we got the two ninjas of Misaka and accelerator. So it looks really cool. Actually, my accelerator is a bit broken. The wing kind of snapped off. I was super annoyed by that, but yeah, it's also pretty bad. I would like to get it replaced, but for the meantime, it's fine. So, yep, got my basically Misa kind of accelerator shrine. Moving on to art books. Well, obviously, you already know about Dengeki Dayo. I might show this in the video. And it's also, this is like a sticker too. But like just Dengeki Dayo. And they got like railgun stuff on the front, if I can open it. So, yeah, got like the railgun 15th anniversary stuff. But I showed that in the video. Next up, we got the light novel art books. We got Index on the cover so this is the first half of old testament so this light novel artwork is awesome but this is also just a general art book featuring the other artists work well like look at that that was like the first half of old testament looks awesome cool quick little flip through so pretty cool and then so that's rainbow spectrum colors and then i got rainbow spectrum notes this is the second half of old testament there's also an art book for New Testament, the first half called Cross, and I'm imagining there will be a second one for the second half of New Testament eventually, but it have not been confirmed yet. So, look at that, so this looks awesome. So it's like, if you watch like Index 3, this stuff would be pretty much familiar to you, and obviously if you read the light novels. So look at that, pretty cool, I love this art book. That's awesome. Then we got Railgun T, official art book, volume one. So if you watch Railgun T, this is the a lot of the artwork used to promote the series and collaborations, key arts, and all of that. So all this iconic, classic artwork. Just see it. And you got some other images in there too. Pretty cool. Then we got volume two as well. So this is the second half of Real Gun T, like you know the Dream Ranker art and all of that. So lots of awesome artwork, and you got like original Real Gun and Real Gun S in there too. Next up, we got some tapestry. So I only have two Tuaru tapestries because my roommates completely filled up with a ton of stuff. But then we got this New Testament 22R Wasp Girl. I know I'm a f Omega Fake fan for owning this, but it looks cool. Got the main characters right there. And then we have this Index 3 wall scroll of Misaka and Kuroko. I like to think of it as like a real gun scroll. Then I got my Index scroll over there. But it looks great. Now we got some random stuff. We got this Drama CD for Mental Out Volume 1. Saw the video on this. Look at that. Looks pretty cool. Right there. And then for the last one, it's actually my most recent pickup. If you don't know anything about Y Shorts, it's an anime trading card game. And I picked these two up. Boom. Look at this. These are signature cards of Toma and Misaka. So these are signed by the Japanese voice actors. And I got this for such a great deal at a local shop in Brooklyn, New York. So I'm in New York City and this is a store called Lumius. So if you're in New York City, definitely check them out. Um, they have a few other cards that I want to pick up. Like they had a Sa and Kuroko and Uiharu that I like to pick up as well to complete my set. But to have these in my collection is super sick. Because why shorts has been a game I've been looking into heavily. There's like a lot of great animes that white shorts have and to see Tuaru at that card shop 
but super sick. So you don't have to get these signature cards. These are one of the coolest things in my collection. All right, guys. So we can wrap up this video here. Thank you so much for watching. I have a lot more videos coming out soon. Hope you all enjoy. Subscribe, like this video, and peace. What do you do? Stay awesome.